Hello everybody, I am Raf and welcome to another video of my YouTube channel. So in this opportunity, I'm going to uh, explain you how to change uh, or customize the um, breadcrumbs in WooCommerce with Elementor. So to get you in more context, there is a custom widget that comes in Elementor and it doesn't have the option to change this icon. So it, it will be better for you user experience to have this like, for example, like a Chevron here. Uh, exactly like the, the Shopify pages or other um, yeah, e-commerce sites that you've probably seen in the past. So um, as you can see here, you can only change text color and you know link color and you know the fonts and alignment. So there is no option to change the icon. So we're gonna do that uh, using some custom code. Like uh, you know some some part is going to be a CSS class, and then it's going to be some uh, PHP. Basically, what we have to do is go here to your appearance menu on the left side. Let me move this here and then look for the theme editor. And for example, here I'm using the Hello Elementor uh, child theme. So in your case, you have to look for the, the theme that you have active. Please, before doing this, uh, have a, you know, a backup of your site and your database as well. So use Duplicator, which is a good option to do that. And well, basically here, I'm going to um, just copy from my uh, editor here and look this okay once this is a uh, paste so basically have uh, something that it's a scripted so in case you want to customize later so this is basically to change uh, the font size and then some margin uh, of the element so I update and then what I'm going to do is just go to the function PHP which is I, I already opened that here so basically I'm going to copy and paste the next piece of code there so here and I'm gonna add it here okay so you have to be careful that um, you have exactly the same uh, name for the class which is this one here breadcrumb uh, hyphen icon so it's going to be here and also you have the exact uh, exact um, class for the uh, fun awesome um, icon. So in my case, I'm using Font Awesome, which is uh, included in Elementor. So please check that you have everything in place, like in here, and then you can just update the file. So once updated, also please check that you have updated here on the CSS, and then go to your um, your builder here and just refresh the page. Wait a minute, and you'll see it like this. So we want to use this one, for example, here. We just take here. I'm gonna copy the, the whole thing because it won't let me copy just a part. And just I'm gonna go to my editor here and just paste. And just take what I just need and just copy here and go to my editor here. So basically I'm just going to remove this. Paste and update. So once updated, I'm just going to refresh. It might take some time depending on your server and connection. And while it's working, so uh, what if I want to change, for example, the space between and the size of the icon? So I just need to go to the uh, CSS style sheet um, file, and then here I'm gonna change this to be one REM, for example, and let's see what happens. It's here and F5. And there you go, it's it's bigger. So in case you want to add more space in between the elements, you just need to go here and obviously take the margin. So let's say I'm gonna put 10 and also I'm gonna put here 10 as well, 10 pixels each size. So uh, let's chance, update, and you'll get it. So uh, it's pretty easy. So, uh, so if you like this video, please hit the like button, subscribe, and share to get more videos like this. So thank you. Bye-bye.